Hello and good evening. My name is John. We're here playing Joe's Diner of This Games Productions, part of my Steam Cleaning series where I go through every game in my Steam library, eventually, then arbitrarily rate and or review them after just a wee bit of playtime. Now, I'm not quite sure what this game is, Joe's Diner, but we're going to hop in and say new game. UIG Entertainment. Oog. Oog? Dis Game. Or is that Viz Games? I think it's Diz. Somewhere along the old Route 7, in the middle of nowhere. Uh huh. Built on the remains of an old Native American cemetery. Well, that's problematic. Is Joe's Diner. It is likely you would have never heard of this place in your life. Had you not been sent there as a vacation replacement for a month. It's a vacation replacement. Clear all the tables okay. and make sure it's quiet during the night shift. That's what the instructions said. Is this like a... But there was a little hitch. Oh, it must be horror based. The cemetery underneath Joe's diner was also the final resting place of two great chieftains. Mm -hmm. In life, Grimfeather and Laughing Bird hated each other and did their utmost to make each other's life a living hell. Even in death, Laughing Bird cannot resist the temptation to rob his former rival of well-deserved peace and will use any means at his disposal. So this is probably going to be a little racist. Night, he does everything he can to make as much clamor as possible and drive Grim Feather crazy, which is the very last thing you want to and will experience. Once Grim Feather gets angry, he takes it out on anyone nearby. Okay. So why don't we just close the diner and give the land back to the people who should rightfully have it? Just a thought. Just just a thought. Let's clean all the tables. Okay. All right. Okay. I, yeah, I'm trying. So I picked up all leftovers. Is this a cat? Alright, in the trash can. Where's the trash can? Is it? There you go. Trash can. No. There. Some spray. Um, there's some leftovers. The window reflections are really weird. Look, can I just leave this door open, please? Oh, here. Okay. Can I turn the lights on? Oh, I do have a flashlight. Okay. Where are the rest of the leftovers? Right 
Where are the leftovers? Why did I wait to the end of the night to bust all this? Is this leftovers? Okay. I only carry one thing at a time. Is it really the TV again? Is this leftovers? No, that's spray paint. Of course, I only take one leftovers at a time. Leftovers. I don't see any leftovers. Oh, is that a leftover? A bottle of wine. What? There's a clock somewhere? Okay, well, I guess I lose. Load key. Now that I know what I'm doing. Oh, stuff is rent. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, use this time to scout. There's the leftovers there. Okay, the clock is actually moving. Mm hmm. That's leftovers, and let's just call it garbage. Why did I wait so long? Like, there's actually like a haunting or something. I should have done this earlier, or just like wait till the morning. Alright, last one's there. But this is seriously only like five minutes of work. Most of the time I spent opening and closing that door. I do it? Wait. Yeah, I'm open. I have a flashlight while I'm working. Turn the lights on. So now I just wait? This is truly the American working experience. This kitchen would never pass inspection. Strike? One action figure. A lobster on the grill? That's just weird. Can I just unplug some of this stuff? There is no one in this town. Is 
actually bug spray or something. This seems really kind of tedious. So most of my work is just standing around. It's good. Hooray! I survived the night shift. Round two. Oh, there's six leftovers now. That burger wasn't even touched. Why would you order a burger and not... I mean, there must be a lot of business for the day shift or the swing shift, but there sure is not anything for... machine someone ordered a pie and didn't eat any of it yeah I gotta get faster to get to that door is that fish Why don't I take it off the pot, the stove so it can't make noise? Um. Are the leftovers in here? No, they gotta be in the diner somewhere. There's a bottle. That makes it really hard to find when it's just like a bottle. Should be also recycling those. Alright, nothing here. See you. Alright, we win. Now to wait a long period of time. Alright, next shift I'm going to intentionally turn everything on and see if I can get this... Uh... Get this ghost to show up. So I'm not having any fun playing this game as naturally. Is that supposed to be a fish? I'm guessing it's supposed to be a fish. Can I leave? I mean, it is, ooh, it is one minute per second though, so... Or more, I guess? Almost 5 a.m. Maybe that's when the night shift ends. Maybe 6 a.m. Yeah, hours are like 30 seconds tops. Six AM, let's do it. Yay. Well, so far this game has been rather uh bland, I would say. We're gonna just try to fail with noise next time and see what happens. Um there hasn't been a jump scare or anything really.
Never! I'll never make sure it's quiet. <laughs> Just a single frame splash is the game over. All right. Well, this has been Joe's Diner, a rather disappointing horror game. Uh, literally a spinning plates game. We're trying to accomplish multiple tasks at once and keep uh, certain interactional points uh, covered. But it really doesn't um, doesn't really nail anything in, in a way that uh, makes it fun. I should say, like it's just. You're walking around the boring environment, turning off the stove. Like, not a lot to it. Cheers. <laughs>